Fraser Coast. The black goo is blooming now in northern Fort Pierce, as well as Hutchinson Island, just north of Jensen Beach, in the Indian River Lagoon. The green goo, another toxic algae bloom, is confirmed in Stewart along the St. Lucie River, west along the canals in Palm City, as well as the Okeechobee Waterway in western Stewart. CBS 12's Jenna Eschbach has more on the toxic dangers. Along the shores of Jensen Beach, just north of Nettles Island, this normally sandy beach is coated in a black goo, what appears to be a cyanobacterium, or toxic algae bloom. We're seeing bigger and bigger blooms. Scientists at Florida Atlantic University's Harbor Branch Oceanographic Institute say there are many concerns on the Treasure Coast about water quality, but this black goo can actually harm you if you touch it. So here we are all the way in northern Fort Pierce along the Indian River Lagoon where we're finding this black algae attaching to the seagrass. This is what they call the black goo, a toxic algae bloom found in salt water that if you ingest or come in contact with can make you sick or burn your skin. It has a, a variety of toxins in it. Um, number. Is black goo worse than green goo? Uh, I would say the green goo is the uh, the one for greater concern. I think it has more potent toxins. Yes, there's also a green goo. And yes, it's more dangerous. Normally found only in fresh water, it's invading the St. Lucie River and saltwater estuary due to Lake Okeechobee freshwater releases. Oh, it's coming from the Okeechobee, no question. The river already struggling from the billions of gallons of dirty water dumped in daily just met its match. Green goo is toxic and it's spreading. Confirmed now in downtown Stewart and Palm City. I started seeing it over by the Palm City Bridge area. It's like an ultraviolet green looking slime floating on the surface of the water. It's the same stuff that coated the river in 2006. But now we have green goo and black goo all at once. And scientists say we're at the tipping point. The water is now harmful to humans. You don't want to be swimming around the green goo uh, or touching it. And uh, the black goo, uh, if you do come in contact with it, I, I think you better wash your hands or your body 